Shine City was one of the most successful rap groups of 2018. Their music hit the billboard with popular songs like Black Star, Bronx Star, and Shine City. They were set to be the next Migos. But what happened? Come with us as we dig deeper into what really happened to Shine City. You think this is easy trying to make a team that's a full with kids? You think it's easy? Try yourself. I lost a million on this. Our Nizzle and D Pro stole their bandmates' track and released their hit song Mac and Cheese, which went platinum. I put them on the map and what they want to do? Break up. The person we don't do, they were trash. I saw them dancing like when walk like school. They were upset. They were trying to they were trying to talk smack too. But everybody knows that we're better. No comments. After hearing the track Six Nas and E Drizzle realized they stole their beat, the controversy flooded social media and diss tracks were released by the groups and other celebrities like Drake, Pusha, Remy Ma, and Nicki. We were all making our own song and the song was called Mac Cheese. And after we made the song, two of our members left. So and they then, stole your song? Yes, they stole our song. We're the original creators of Mac and Cheese, but they left the group and took the song with them. In the studio. We're making a song called Cheese and Mac. I'm really mad, because we were going up, we were making all that money, we could have went to like Las Vegas or something, and then they make a, a track called Mac and Cheese. Like, are you serious? Mac and cheese? Are you guys hungry? That my fans are supporting me, so yeah. I What's your new album that you're working on? No Mac, no cheese. Um, is there anything you'd like to say to the band? No. Well, I would like to say if we could, if we could all get back together and, and do what we used to do. Like, like a reunion? Yeah. Yes. So what I'm hearing is that you two want a reunion with the band. Yes. yes.